Good morning guys morning. and welcome back to Disneyland. The sun is shining. We came at this morning, I've put my hoodie on and I'm already warm. It's blue skies guys, there's a few clouds but not many. They're like the misty yeah. clouds. No, today in California for us in obviously Anaheim is going to be the hottest day today. I, yeah, I think it says highest to 26. I think so, so I hope so. I'm going to be melted <laughs> like a laugh in a puddle. Yeah, no we have no <laughs> sun cream on just yet but we will do after. I'm going to take this jumper off and put my, um, my Roosevelt shirt on. Oh, Okay. Yeah, I think it's the one your mum and dad got me. The, the oh, that's a nice one. I love that one. Hey, so we wore the same thing in Florida. I wore this dress and you wore that. We're outfit repeating. I mean, by the way, this wasn't okay. intentional. This is so meant to be then. This is meant to be. <laughs> that's so funny. So the anyway. plan today is to spend some part of the day in Disneyland California, and then yes. we're gonna head over to Downtown Disney because we've never been there before. Don't even know what they have there, what no. restaurants, what shops or anything. So we'll take you guys along. We'll do yeah. a bit of shopping. Now the only thing we know they've definitely got is obviously the World of Disney. We've seen that from here. So yeah, we, we can see that from here. Like yeah. it's over there. So yeah, so we definitely want to head over there for uh, maybe an hour or so. Grab some dinner. Have a look around the shops. Maybe Maybe, but yeah, we could grab some food. Pri priority for today. I really want to jump on the Matterhorn. That is a priority. We'll check the wait time when we get in. So watch I'm not it, sure. Watch it not run again, I'm after. I know, sake. yeah. Um, time wise, it's 20 to 9. So we've had a bit of like a relaxed morning. We didn't think we needed to rush. We thought, right, as soon as we get in bed, we're going to give ourselves seven hours sleep. Yeah, we did. We'll get up, get ready, and just go like no rushing. We were straight in the park, straight through security. There's no queues or anything. Look at that. And we're in. Yeah. Look at that. So, we'll get some pics as we'll well. We'll stop rambling. Uh, with that being said, let's head on in to Disneyland California. We didn't come in this way last time. We didn't. No. Cause look at look at that, how pretty that is. What is that? It's the art shop. Oh, that's but, where we bought our art from. Yeah, but I never noticed how pretty the outside was, but it was dark. The music. Oh my God. Oh, the heart. We, need, we do need to get on one of these at some point. Yes, we do. Just oh, look at him. Everything about this park. This is, I'm going to say it's my favourite park. It is. It's just, it's my favourite. Well, out of all of them in the world that e we've been to? Every single one we've been to, this is by far my favourite. You know what I, I also love about it is? <gasps> no. What? The fire department <gasps> scrims down. No. no. I said this. Nah, you're having us on. I said I'll message them and they'll get it off. Right. Let's go. What? It's open. What? Did they, did they watch our vlog when we said? I think they watched our edits and said oh. we're going to get it off for LNS Adventures. Oh my God, it's open as well. Like there's a oh. car there, one of the fire carts. I can't believe it. Well, I can't see the light on because it's too bright. Yeah. However, the scrim has gone. Oh this is the, my God. This is, oh no, because we didn't come in yesterday. They nope. could have took it down yesterday. I was going to say this might be no, the first day. They definitely did it today for us. So for those of you who don't know, obviously this is where Walt, uh, Walt's apartment is. Now, I'm pretty certain he didn't obviously live here for time, of course, but he did have meetings here and no, um, he had his, um, family, family and friends over. Yeah, but he had his house and then this wow. was like where he would stay. And of course, the light is continuously on. You can see it, that you can see the light, but you can't see the actual bulb yeah. being on, but you can see the actual light itself. Can we go inside here? Because you used to be able to, Let's I'm pretty in. sure. I can't believe it. I genuinely can't believe it. I swear I thought we weren't going to see this. Oh, we're inside. Oh my God. Hey look, there's a fire um, pole. It's amazing, isn't it? Oh, the, just up there, through the, through the ceiling is his apartment. It's Walt's apartment. Can you imagine walking through in and Walt's just hanging out the window like, morning. So you can do a tour and go in it, however, I don't think we're going to do it, are we? No. But hear us out, it's because it used to be a three hour tour-ish, but now they've, um, it's now 90 minutes and yeah. they've hired the price. So we were like, I don't know whether that's, considering we did the um, Keys to the Kingdom tour and that was five hours. Yeah. Like it was more than what we paid for that. And we just thought, you know what? I don't know. So we've not got it booked in, have we? I no. mean, you know what? Maybe next time. We've got the it's studio. It's something we could tour. do next time. Yes. Spoiler alert: We're actually going to the actual Disney Studios. So we I'm happy with that. Yeah. Wow. I'm so happy.
morning. I'm just getting some shots, you know, my uh, cinematic mode on my iPhone. Everyone always asks me what I use for my videos. Just this. Just the iPhone. Just my iPhone, cinematic mode, banging. So we've just had some pictures with the castle just there and we saw a dog with ears on. I can't cope. I can't cope. <laughs> What's his Instagram? I need to follow I him. I know. So we've just checked on the Disneyland app and Matterhorn is up and running and it's currently posted at a 20 minute wait. So of course we're we just have gonna to do it. smash it out now and then maybe get breakfast after, yeah? Oh, so at I, least listen, we've got this one ride done. I'm in absolutely no rush for food right now. Uh, I'm hungry, but yeah, I just I'd rather do this. I'd rather do this. While so it's 20 minutes. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna see if I can put my chest mount on, see if I can record it. Oh yeah, we could ask. Yeah. Oh, um, I'll, uh, I'll do it with the Insta360, I'll see you anyway. But 20 minutes, that's going to jump on the mat hard. Still currently posted at a 20 minute wait. Can we just appreciate this wait time box as well? Look at that. Oh, it's a castle. Cinderella, oh, it's not Cinderella's castle, is it? I don't know whose it is, actually. Whose castle is that? To be honest. It can't be this one here, it doesn't look like. God knows, but it's a cute castle. Either way. I'll take it. I love the detail. So, good news. I asked him, he said, of course you can. So, you can use GoPro chessments on this ride. I, I figured you could anyway. It's Disney. They're usually quite good with allowing yeah, you to film on rides anyway. it's not like we're anyway. holding something. It's literally strapped to your chest, so what it can't fall off. No. It's all tangled, right? I'll get it set up anyway. Get your strap on. So we've just come off the mat horn now. I really, really enjoyed it. It was a lot smoother than I thought it was. Yeah. Be, but apparently, we spoke to some people in the queue. There's two tracks. Yeah. And we were on the smoother one of the two. Yeah. And it was a lot tamer than I thought. Yeah, but so I really enjoyed it. it's not scary at all. Yeah, also, I really enjoyed it, yeah. Um, it wasn't 20 minutes, that was a lie. It was uh, 40. <laughs> Oh yeah, it yeah, was. it was a while to be fair. I don't think they'd updated it, but it was worth it to be fair. Now, because you, you really wanted to get on it. Yeah. So we've done it now. You know so, what? And I'm it might go down so, again. So, so glad. Yeah, I really enjoyed it. Yeah, so the plan now is obviously we've come off there. I do want to ride it again though. I want to go on the other track. Um, but we've just noticed Alice in Wonderland is also a 20 minute wait. So just before we go and get some food, I think we're going to go and jump on this, yeah, hit the toilets, this. and then yes. go and grab this one some breakfast because we've not eaten yet. No, and I'm getting hungry now, but I need a restroom as well. But let's go and see Alice. Celebrate my uh, unbirthday. Your unbirthday. Yeah, which I'm now going to celebrate throughout the yeah. day, I think. And then we'll go get food. Let's do it. Here we go. Hey, Luz. <laughs> oh. Have you done this before? Nope. This way. No, no, that way. Yeah. 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 Wow. This reminds me of Pinocchio. Oh, yeah, a little bit. Oh, it's a caterpillar. Oh. <laughs> what a beautiful butterfly. Long film, mate. Long film. Oh, this is curious. Try this way. Wow. Always the drop. So let the pain be spent. Ah, with their head. Ah, it's not good. Oh, my goodness. Hey, do we go inside? Oh, do you know what would be perfect now, Luz? If a monorail came past. Oh, well, you called oh, it. Oh, I called it. You called it, mate. Hello. 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 Hello.
nice for kids. Not very I, thrilling for me, but... Excuse me, I enjoyed that. <laughs> Do you enjoy it? Yep. Yep. So we've just seen Captain Hook. I'm going to see if he'll have a selfie with us. Hello! Hook, can we have a selfie with you? Is that okay? Oh Fantastic. my god, amazing! Oh, this was nice. It was about 20 minutes. It was a nice little kids ride. It was peaceful. I enjoyed that. I love how you go outside on the roof. Yeah, I did. You and then go the, out in the sun for a little bit. And, and then the, the monorail. Mono you called it, didn't you? I called it. And then as soon as we came out, we saw Captain Hook. We'll drop the uh, selfie in as well. What a great character meet that was. Hey, look, Peter Pan's here. Okay. Oh, that's Peter. Shall we go and show him uh, our selfie? Oh, no, he's probably going to hate us. <laughs> I, I feel like he's going into it. I don't remember. That's um, the Tinkerbell area. Oh, do you think he's... So I think he might be going in there, maybe. Yeah, he might do. But do you know what? I, I prefer Captain Hook self than a Peter Pan one. Yeah, I do. So I do. Peter, but... Um, I love that they just walk around. Like, I absolutely love it. You could just be turn a corner and you'll see a character straight away and you're like, oh my God, and then snap a picture. There's no and queuing. And they're not with another... I didn't see Hook with another cast member nope. then. He's, he's just, just like on his own walking around. And yeah. You're not, you're not getting people like running over like that's how like chilled this park yeah. is like I, love I absolutely it. love that and I love doing this selfie trick that Viv taught us yeah. with the characters it's sick Cheers, I've never Viv. had um, selfies of characters before but we do now don't we and now we are um, we are it. now back onto Main Street now the castle is just to my right now and we're going to get some breakfast because we're getting starving now we're really I need a hungry. restroom still Oh, but yeah, she's been needing this restroom for about two hours yeah it's because we were like we was like we'll go on Matterhorn then I'll go on restroom and then when we got off we were like let's just go on um, Alice while it's 20 minutes and then we'll do the restroom and I've like, still not had it yet. You know what? Restroom, then breakfast. Yes. This is the place that we want to go to for breakfast. Yeah, this is where we're going to go. So it's called Jolly Holiday Bakery Cafe and I think they do a nice toasty. Yeah, because Lucy's had the cheese toasty before it's because I'm, of the soup. Yeah, and I'm pretty sure it's from here and you get soup to dip into tomato. You know so what? That sounds up my street. That's not something I would typically get, but I think I'm going to give it a try, you know, because it always looks amazing when Lucy gets it, and I always think, why didn't I get that? See, I have good choices, you yeah, know. You definitely do. Right. Well, not always. Not when, you, not when you order a sticky toffee pudding over like a brownie sundae. Don't diss sticky toffee pudding. It's the best dessert ever. Give over. <laughs> Ain't got nothing on the Ghirardelli. I do like a Ghirardelli, though, to be fair. <laughs> Behind the scenes of the monster footage. <laughs> Look at him. Did you get that? Yeah. Whoa! <laughs> Did you get that shot? Make a bloody show of me. Did you get it? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay. I'm, amazing. I'm... <laughs> <laughs> Listen, right. Hear me out, right. Listen. I just these are my favourite moments. Okay. So I want to capture them. Well, I want to capture my memory, not with you with a bloody camera behind me. Disturbing anyway. me. Can I have my can cooler back? By the way, this can cooler. It's. I mean, ice, ice cold. So I stole this in the freezer overnight and then obviously I put this in. Ice cold. It's literally freezing. And it's been out for what, three hours now, I'd say? Yeah. Ice cold. I've got my monster with me today as well, guys. But I'm going to have it a bit later. This is too early for me. The time currently is. Oh, it's quarter to 11. Not too bad. Hey, cheers, mate. Hey, just me and my mate. You and your twin. Mmm. Oh, what? So this is the Jolly Holiday Bakery Cafe that we said we're going to get breakfast from. They do the toasties. It says they do mobile order, so I think we should do that. We've been using mobile order a lot this trip, haven't we? Yeah, it's so, so much quicker. I'm, I'm like, Yeah, it really is. You, you do look at some of the queues, you think, oh, I can't stand in that. And then mobile order, and within 30 seconds, you've got your food. Yeah, pretty much. And plus, the weather outside, we may as well stand and wait in yeah. the sun while Whoa, they cook it so that's unusual for you to say that you're like shade 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 and i'm like loose yeah but it's not wait ask me this again when it's like 3 p.m and it's yeah, like true, 30 true. degrees do you know what i mean oh my, is that mary pop oh my god it is i don't know guys if you can see mary poppins that's yeah. cool hey do you know what they call me at work you know they call me mary poppins at work how funny is that? Is that because you've got a massive bag? Or? I've heard it's something to do with my amazing singing voice and my amazing dancing and I walk around with a uh, very Mary Poppins type umbrella. Oh right! And I always do my nan's shopping and stuff so I've always got bags with me so they call me Mary Poppins. And to be fair, the size of this bag you've got now, the amount of stuff we can pull out of that, that's definitely Mary Poppins a bag in it. full of sugar makes the medicine go down. Oh god, cool. <laughs>
So I went for the cheese toast. I also went for two desserts as well. I went for a vanilla and cherry macaron, and I also went for a lemon meringue eclair, which again, I've never seen before, but they looked amazing. I know Ben will appreciate that lemon meringue um, eclair. So the cheese toast, I didn't get the soup with mine because it's quite big. Lucy got the soup, so we're gonna share the soup. Yeah, we are, yeah. Yeah, so I'm gonna do this. Can I oh. just point out while Steve's gonna pull that apart? We didn't actually do mobile order because it was saying an hour wait on mobile order. Wow! So we queued. How long did we queue? About 10 minutes. Yeah. In this case, mobile order did not work. No, it did not work. It wasn't the best option. So for all three of these things, it cost me $26. I didn't get a drink. So that's the size of the soup as well. So yeah, we're just going to share it. Right, here we go. Lucy said it's really good, so I can't wait. Yeah, I've had this before. Mmm. Mmm. Nice, isn't it? That bread, crispy on the outside. I think it's sourdough bread, but I don't know. Crispy on the outside, super, super soft on the inside, and that cheese is amazing. Mm. Right, I'm gonna try mine. That's incredible, that. 10 out of 10, incredible. So, like we just said before, I went for the Jolly Holiday combo, so it's basically the cheese toasted with the soup. It's tomato and basil soup. I got um, um, a Mickey cookie with milk chocolate on, but I'm not gonna get it out yet. I'll show you that when I'm eating it, because we sat in the sun, so I don't want it to melt. And I got a large fountain beverage, Minute Maid lemonade. Be rude not to, right? Be rude not to. Came to 27.23 for the three. Right. I mean, you've just done this food taste test, but. Oh. oh my god, how insane is that? I like the cheese. Nice and made to cheers. Ben could not cook this amount of cheese, could he? No, definitely not. That tomato basil soup is incredible. I love the combination as well. Mm. It's really, really nice. As good as you remember, or what? I mean, it looks nothing exciting, does it? Let's be honest, but it really is. Toasty with soup. Such a good combo. Okay, both toasties demolished. Do you know what? Dessert time. I could have happily had two of those, 100%. That was the more I ate it, the better it got. You know, mm -hmm. oh, definitely one of one of the, the nicest things to have here for breakfast. It's super, super light. I'm I not think it's weird. quite popular to get as well. Yeah, it sounds weird because it's cheese and cheese is quite heavy, but soup, that combination was mm -hmm. top tier. Yeah, can you, I'm just thinking, can you imagine the Disneyland Paris toast stick with a, a side of tomato basil oh. soup? Like that would be the best combo, wouldn't it? That would be top tier. That would be elite level. That would be worth going to Paris alone for, wouldn't it? Anyway, yeah. dessert right. time. So, You've got two. Of course I've gone for two. Now, the only reason for this is, is one, I'm greedy. No, it's two reasons. I'm greedy and I couldn't decide which one I wanted. So I don't typically get a lemon meringue anything, really. I'm more like chocolate, stodge, claggy. You know what I mean? But I went for two. I went for the cherry macaron. That's with vanilla as well. Cherry, right. Yeah. Right. So I'm just going to go for the lemon meringue eclair first. I'm going to give it a try. Yeah, it's weird seeing you not get like full on chocolate dessert. It's branching out, guys. Wow. Wow. That lemon is so fresh. And you know what? Compared to the last eclair we had on Disney, which was, sorry, that was in Universal, it was quite hard. The oh, actual yeah, eclair. The chocolate one. This is incredible. I, I, actually, I think. I think I prefer it over chocolate. Do yeah. Mmm. What's the inside of it look like? We do a little. Wow. Keep it there. Hopefully that's in focus, guys. That's amazing. Right. Put wow. it down. Try the macar macaron, macaroon. No, I do like macaron, so I hope this is. Oh, and it feels super soft as well. It's big, that, isn't it? Wait till you see my cookie, guys. It's massive. Do a little inside shot. It's got vanilla and cherry in it. That's delicious. It's not as good as yesterday's Mickey Mouse one. Oh yeah, the Snickers brownie one. That was amazing, but that's because it's stodgy and chocolatey. This is, again, super fresh. And the macaroni is spot on as well. Like, you know, the, 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 the cracking of the, of the shell and the chewiness inside. So out of the two, I'm guessing, are you preferring the, uh, the lemon meringue? 100%. Tart. That's Quite unusual for me, that, isn't it? Yeah. That doesn't normally happen. No, no really. don't get me wrong. I do think like things like lemon curd, lemon meringue, but that is immense. That is unbelievable. Okay, so this is the size of it. Look at the size of that. It says it's a shortbread cookie, so I'm hoping it's not like a sugar cookie and it's actually shortbread. Do we chocolate on it? Look how cute it is. It's nice, that. It's soft, I saw that. Oh, it's more like a shortbread, which is, is good, yeah. Then um, 
you know, than a sugar cookie because I'm not, you know, I'm not a massive fan of that. It's yeah. melting already. <laughs> it is warm, by the way. I think it's already 22 degrees already. Is that good? Mmm. I'm excited to try the white chocolate bit. Oh. You know, it's best. Sorry, Mickey. Was he earless now? What do I think is better, mine or yours? Oh. Don't, God. don't you dare. You'd have gone in and bought me another one. I don't mind, I'd have had this. Mm. That chocolate needs to be thicker. So the biscuit itself, the shortbread itself is really good. But yeah. I personally don't think there's enough chocolate on that. Mm. Like it's only a very, very fine line of chocolate on it. But overall, it gets a solid six because it is nice. But I think I prefer the, you know, the Main Street confectionery cookie, you know, the big one. Right. I'd love to try that. We've not tried it yet. I'm surprised because you're a cookie girl. I know. I just don't, if it's a sugar cookie, I just mm. don't want it. Yeah. No, really nice. Really nice. That lemon meringue eclair, top tier. Really, really good, that one. We have just finished up with breakfast. It was beautiful. Such a good shout. Well done, you. That's why we make lists before we come out, just so we can get out here and be like, oh, what should we get? And Lucy's there with a the list like, mm, I want to try this. That actually wasn't on the list. I just remember not? having it from last time. I remember. I mean, you can't really go wrong with cheese toast, no. can you, so far? It's going to be good anyway. Yeah. So we finished there. Now we've decided to look on the Disneyland app again, check the wait times, and we've just seen that Davy Crockett's Explorer Canoes is five minutes. So Lucia's not a big fan of it because it is warm, so she might be sweating by the end of it. But no, I'm not. I just thought, like, I was just think, thinking, I don't want to get sweaty, but you know what? Let's just do it because I think it'll be fun. I think it'll be fun. Yeah, it's going to be really nice. I'm, I've never done anything I mean, like this before. No, um, I don't know how good you have to be of a canoe. Wait. Canoe? Do we actually have to row it, or is it on a track? No, I think we have to row it. No. Oh, yeah. oh. What if we rolled off somewhere else? What if we? Because there's a woman with us. I tell you I, what. There's people. There's cast members with us. I'm not sure. You know. I don't know. I don't think so. I was gonna say ask her, but she'll probably say no. You're on yourself. Yeah. Not to spoil the magic if it is on a track. Either way, five minute wait. We're definitely gonna go if and do it. If it's on a track, that means I don't have to row. Yeah. Exactly. Let's do it then. One thing I definitely like about this park is I love the fact that people dress up. So we've just seen a uh, family dressed up as Mary Poppins. So you obviously had uh, Mary Poppins herself. The kids were like little chimney sweeps. You had Bert. And he even had, he even had soot on his face, didn't he? They were dressed up like Disney bounding. It wasn't yeah. like full on she looked like Mary Poppins. No. You're not allowed to do that. But, but they were, you could tell who they were. Yeah. That was sick, yeah, like you said, he even a saw his face, yeah. like he, he, he went all in, didn't he? Yeah, that's what I mean, and it happens throughout the park, you see loads of people dressed up, like I said, not identical to the characters, you're not allowed, but yeah. there's certain things that they're wearing that obviously represent the characters, see which... It more, more than we saw, well, we see in Florida. Yeah, 100%. Anyway, we've noticed it a lot, even like the baby and stuff is dressed up. I know, I know. And the little girl is dressed as like a mini... Mary Poppins. Mini so Mary Poppins cute. and like a, like a, a mini chimney sweep. So that's that's Aww. definitely one thing I love about this park. So you can see Tiana's Bio Adventure is coming along nicely. I'm really looking forward to riding this. Me too. I feel like the Florida one's going to be opening soon, you know. Yeah, I do. I don't know if these are close to. It doesn't look like it. I think these are behind, don't they? Because yeah. I feel like the Florida one closed before this one did. Nice. So this one will be behind on um, theming. I mean, you can see a bear there. That's clearly not. Yeah, they're a bit behind. Tiana. Yeah, they're a bit behind. <laughs> but I'm excited to ride it. Oh, where's the canoes? Hey, oh, we've just seen a canoe go by, by the way. Um, you don't have to roll. There's loads of people just sat there. So Lucy was like, great, I won't roll then. Well, David Crockett's Explorer Canoes. Fantastic. Wait, 10 is it up till here? 5. So it looks like it's a walk on. Because is it just going to be me and you in this, in this canoe? Because if it is, I'm going to have to row, aren't I? I hope it is just me and you. Oh, damn it. How cool would that be? I'm going to have to stretch. I like. Oh, oh I'll get you on. A, oh, one tall one for you, so you're tall guy. Oh, it's just a bigger one. <laughs> Come on, I need a, a man's bigger. one, a man's <laughs> paddle. <laughs> I'm a man. So we're not allowed just me and Steve. We have to have 10, don't we, people? Yes. So we wait for eight more. But I can see people coming. Yeah, they're coming down now. There we, we need go. our team members. They're coming. Like and subscribe. Hit that like button right now. Thank you so All much. All comments in the comments section. Like Love Davy Clark Explore Canoes. Hey! <laughs> Let me help you guys out. How are you guys doing? Hey, everybody, smile. You're on their YouTube video. <laughs> 
Came from the UK. <laughs> 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 Fantastic. <laughs> 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 Oh my god, I love that. But yeah, we have to jump on the mic today. Yeah, Amazing. Aww. Right, I'm so glad we did these canoes. See, I told you. <laughs> she never listens we're to gonna me. We're going to race this boat, aren't we? That's what we're going to do. Wow. Yeah, we need to jump on the mic today, 100%. Yeah, I feel like we should, yeah. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Y'all have no idea what you're doing yet! This takes years and years and two days of training to master. First of all, how are we doing today? Good. Good. I put those paddles up. Let me show you how to do this. Inside hand, grab the top of the oar. Outside hand by the water. Grab the bottom closer by that blade. On the count of three, we're going to stick our paddles directly in the water. Ready? Let's try this. Everybody's watching you. One, two, three. Stroke! Stroke. Got me. Yeah. That's it, folks. That is it. No, that's literally it. That's all we're doing. Come on. That was amazing. I, I absolutely love it. It was so much better than we thought it was. Oh, and also to clarify, it is a trackless ride. So if you don't roll, you don't go. Yeah, there's um, a guy canoeing with you at the front and then like a steerer at the back of it, isn't there? Yeah, yeah. So, so good. Obviously I spent most of it not rowing because I was like, um, Oh yeah, we so all noticed that. <laughs> We all know who the real team player was. Yeah, not me. And it was me, guys. Who'd have thought I'd have been the best rower on that boat? But even like the cast member, so Michael was obviously our guide. It was so funny, and oh, obviously he was sick. Yeah, they were sick. Like yeah. that, that's that's the Disney cast magic, you know. Yeah. That's that's what you come here for, because yeah. obviously when they treat you like that, amazing, amazing. So yeah, they're definitely. Really good. I did enjoy that actually. I, I knew you would. It's amazing. Well, I think we did well, right? I we did well, yeah. It was amazing. Oh, um, look where we are. So we actually haven't been into Galaxy's Edge once this trip yet. So we've decided we saw Smuggler's Run. It's currently posted at a 20 minute. So we decided, you know what? Yeah. Let's go into Galaxy's Edge because wow. the only one I've seen is the one in Florida. So I'm yeah. assuming it's going to be similar, just yeah. on a smaller scale. I don't know which one was first, but guys, can you hear all these sounds? And the train in the background. Like that's that's louder than Florida's, right? Yeah. Oh, for like, sure. I don't even know what's going on. There's like space shuttles, helicopters, the train, all sorts of noise. Yes, yeah, I love that's it. That's amazing. But yeah, it feels weird that there's a Galaxy's Edge in Disneyland. Yeah, it does. Cause so like, you see people walk past the castle and they've all got lights, lightsabers and they're dressed up and you think, that's so strange because normally, obviously, we're used to Florida it being at the Hollywood Studios. And yeah. not Magic Kingdom. That's it. So it's seeing like, someone walk up Main Street with lights every is wild. Yeah. It's like Magic Kingdom having a Galaxy's Edge. Yeah. It ju it's just really weird, but wow. wow. <laughs> oh, that is different. And that in the the um, in the background, all the rocks there. Wow. That's well different. So I'm assuming that's Galaxy's Edge. That's currently posted. <laughs> no. At, sorry. Uh, Rise, that's of Rise of Resistance. Sorry. 75. Um, that's a 75 minute wait. Yeah, we're so. not queuing for that. We're but Smuggler's Run did say 20. But we'll see when we get there. Oh, there's like smoke, everything coming from that. And I really like Smuggler's Run. I hope I get to drive it. because I know, I, yeah, if we I'm can be the pilot. Clearly we both the best. Be. Clearly not. 
I'm off to find Chewbacca. We want a selfie with him. Who with Chewy? Yeah. Oh yeah, you look like Chewy. What, nice and friendly? Oh, big and fluffy. <laughs> wow. I'll fight you, me. You know what? As somebody who isn't oh. a massive Star Wars fan, this is insane. It's, I think it's definitely louder than Florida. Oh, 100%. Like the sounds and stuff. Like, and just walking through all the bushes and the smoke and all sorts. Uh, this is very similar. This is like the marketplace, right? Yeah. And you know what I love as well, Luce? It's not as hectic as Orlando's. Oh, yeah. Yeah, absolutely. Right. Right, so he's found some clocks. You, you can't be doing a Harry Potter impression in here, you know. Who says? Well, come on, you. I would never. I'm gonna. I'm gonna do a. Um, oh. I'm gonna do a new one. Oh, you're doing a new one, are you? A Disney, a Disney version. Yeah. Right. Okay. Right, a Disney one. <laughs> oh God. Oh, oh, oh. No, you can't. <laughs> no, wrong part. I am your father. If you leave your head on, bam, bam. I like this. That would suit you. Going back on the canoe, wearing that. Right, I'll take it. And actually do some rowing this time, yeah? So as we walk through Galaxy's Edge, I'm gonna show you some of the merch that they've got. This is $30. great quality. Ah. It feels amazing, doesn't it? Yeah. This is $30, this, which I think is pretty cheap. It's really soft. I also like this. What we're talking for that, Luce? 40. It's not bad and it feels great. Whoa. I love the colour, this, this blue colour. Can we all just appreciate this mug? I've seen that before, you know, in the um, Hollywood Studios version. Do you know what it reminds me of? My Jurassic, Jurassic Park. Park. Yeah. Want another tequila shot, Steve, like you did in the airport? Absolutely not. But you know what? It weren't that bad, but I still don't want to show Can I show you these little cute key rings? Yeah. Look. Oh, how much are we talking? 14. 14.99. Oh. Aren't they really cute? Yeah. And obviously they've got more cups here as well, which are pretty cool. What we're we talking for this. It is $29.99, which again I don't think is too bad. I like them the design. Are they pins? Yeah. Obviously a huge selection of pins. I say huge, there's only like three different ones there, but mm. this jacket is really nice too. $50. That's not bad, you know. Anything on my back? No. no. And I the like cap. the colour. Look at the cap as well, Luz. How nice is that? 30. That's not bad, you know. I like it. I like it's the colours. Yeah. I, I like also like combo. that photo frame there. I don't think you make it because the lighting's a bit off in here. Yeah, I don't know where that is actually. Because it's not on like the shelves. Hmm. Oh, no, some really, really good stuff. Yeah, I might be needing one of these I know, today. Yeah. Oh, is that fun? No way. <laughs> I'm surprised you don't own anything like this. You're the, you're the first to say that you're too hot. I'm I know, sure. yeah. This will set you back. To, oh, that's not bad, 22 27 Bit of a random uh, price, but. Coaster set. Well, they're all that are if you want to look at what ones there are. Oh, I like These them. These are 25 for That's four. good, you're keeping for a long time. Yeah. Nice. I like them. I like the, like the wooden style. Ronto wrap. Roasters, guys, where you can get the Ronto wrap is here as well. And you all know I love a Ronto wrap. We've had it a couple of times and it's so good. It I is. would definitely recommend it. It's definitely one of those snacks type uh, meals that you think, oh, it's not too bad. And the, the more you eat it, the nicer it gets as well. Yeah. Isn't that's, it? That's the one, if you remember, where I said I was going to share with Steve and then I left him like that much. I know, right? <laughs> oh, there's the Millennium Falcon. Oh, okay, yeah, so it's, it's set out very similar now, this bit, isn't it? The yeah. marketplace. Ronto Roasters and then you come out to this, this is exactly the same as Florida. With the heat, the sun. Oh my god, this is so weird actually. Wow. I like very much. Oh. I would like to take home. Do you feel like it's bigger? I feel like it's bigger. I feel like they might be closer to us, you know, the rocks at the background. Yeah. Sorry if we're calling them rocks and they actually called something else in Star Wars, I don't know. Um, I feel like... They are definitely bigger. Yeah, and I feel like they're closer to us. Wow. It seemed 35 minutes yeah, for should we do it? Smuggler's Run. I think we should do it. This is the group I've been waiting for. Yes. Come in, come in. 
we are pilots. I wanted pilots as well. I'm gonna show you how it's done, Moose. I'm gonna show you how it's done. Good luck to you all. You might need it. Today's flight takes you to the planet Corellia. Go, let's go, 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 go. For your safety, remain seated and supervise younglings. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. We're gonna crash. Right, I'm not gonna film this because we need to do well. So let's go. Hyperdrive leak. That is not too good. We did our best, didn't we, Lou? I did amazing. Okay, that's up. Well, guys, we've just come out the ride in Chewy's there. Yeah, there's too many people. I don't think we'll be able to get a selfie with him. I love Chewy. Oh, he's as hairy as you. So it was, in fact, a, in fact, it was spot on, 35 minutes bang on the nose. Yeah, it weren't too bad, actually. No, I didn't I feel like it was too long. No, not at all, not at all. It, I mean, the queue constantly moves, so it doesn't feel too long. That way you don't get sore feet by just standing in the same yeah, spot for Yeah, and I'm um, glad that we were pilots. It made the weight, like, worth yeah. it, do you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, if we were engineers or something, I'd be like, oh, god damn it. And we love being the pilots. It's so much more interactive. You feel like you're doing more. Yes. But no. And I did the um, up and down, which I've never done before. Yeah, to be fair, I was quite impressed because I was like, whoa, whoa, and then you actually had it. So, well in done. It, in it. I'm actually a good driver. Well. A good pilot. You, you can't be saying that and then say, actually, you're not. I like, was saying I, to her, like, whoa, fair play, well done. There was one point where I was like, come on then, stay. Like, you have to go right and you went left or something. So actually, <laughs> oh, man. yeah. You're and we, we were crashing into sides because you weren't going left or right. Yeah. But you know what? Great ride. But yeah, it is exactly the same as yeah. Florida, to be fair. Like the ride queue and everything is the same, yeah. isn't it? Yeah. It was really good. So we've just checked wait times. Fanny Nemo was showing a five minute. Yeah. And we've not done that yet. So, I mean, by the time we walk over, could change. But we're thinking if we're heading that direction. Finding yeah. Nemo? That's the submarine one, right? Yes. That's going to be sick. Well, it's, it's all right. It's a nice little ride. Oh, you know, okay. it's cute. Well, um, I prefer the Finding Nemo ride in Epcot. Oh, really? Yes. Well, this is real. You go in a submarine. Well, yeah, you do actually go in a submarine and you move. However, you've got the manatees, so aren't you in the Epcot oh, one? And the like, yeah. aquarium after. So it's a whole light like, experience. Yeah, I know what you mean. Yeah. So, I actually think we're coming into Frontierland this way, do you? Yes. We actually don't know where we're going, we're just walking, and I feel like this is coming into where Thunder Mountain, yeah it is, it so is. this is where Thunder Mountain is. But we've seen a few rides that are currently posted really, really low, so we said get a few more rides and then we might sit down on Main Street, grab a snack, <gasps> Disney Coke. Oh, and just, well just, I've got a monster that I want to crack oh, yeah. open. And just people um, watch for I a might, bit. I might get some popcorn. Yeah. and have that with my monster you know and just have a little chill yeah. but i don't know if it gets too hot though i'm gonna to have to find some shade yeah, well yeah i mean we could we could sit on main street somewhere and that way but as long as we can, i can sit the sun you can sit the shade yeah we'll just people watch for a bit because that's yeah. one of my favorite things to do in uh, magic kingdom also character spot guys jesse Where? she's up here on the Is bridge it? having oh, yeah. pictures i wonder if you can get a selfie with her quick they're quick if we get a selfie with her, we'll pop it in now. If we don't, then you won't see it. <laughs> if we don't, there won't be a selfie. <laughs> so guys, we can see Cinderella and we're going to go and see if we can get a selfie with her. Fingers crossed. Damn it, she walked off, guys. She left us. She, she weren't picture ready, I don't think. Not need Cinderella. We've got a selfie with Gaston now. Oh, I went up to her and so I was like, you won't refuse a selfie, will you? <laughs> of course you would, like, it's Gaston. Yeah, he, he was picture ready. Yeah. He just made it out of a bush, pretty much. Yeah. And I was like, oh my God, there's Gaston. So yeah, we got a quick picture of him, we'll insert it. Yeah, I loved it. Yeah, it was really good, weren't it? He was. Fair. Dead quick, dead snappy, fantastic. Yeah, yeah, really, really good.
have just come off the Finding Nemo ride. It did take roughly around about 40 minutes, didn't it, in total, I would say. So obviously... What, for queuing and then riding it? Yeah, because originally it did say five minutes, and then by the time we got there, it said 20, and then yeah. it, it, it obviously was a little bit longer than, than they, they claimed. Um, but yeah. you know what? It was nice. It was really good. I would say, however, if you are claustrophobic, do not get in it because... Oh, yeah. I'll yeah. Yeah, I should have probably said that before. It is very small and tight. Yeah, in it's that. very tight. So yeah. now obviously we don't suffer from any sort of claustrophobia or anything, so we're good. But if you do suffer from it, maybe don't go on it. Uh, but it was good. I enjoyed it. It was a nice little piece for a ride. I feel like it was great because it went on for quite a while. Yes, didn't it? It went Captain on. Um, it went on a lot longer than I remember. Yeah. But I really enjoyed it actually. Right. It was Just nice. need some um, real animals, doesn't it? Swimming. Yes. It, swimming swimming in the sea with you and then you know us humanity yeah, that, <laughs> that's all it's missing just the real life animals um, <laughs> no they had the actual finding Nemo animatronics and stuff so yeah, it was really did. good so it was really good we've just headed back to main street now we're going to grab a snack maybe a drink and just kind of chill out i've just seen that there's a lot of people sitting and waiting which tells me there's going to be some form of parade probably the one we watched which is great because i really want to see merlin again because when we oh. saw him the other day he was a vibe yeah, well, it's nearly half two now, yes, so I wonder... Show. Oh, is it on at three, the first it's one? It's got to be. Ah, so we might, we might yeah. be able to see it again then. Yeah, because now, I, I don't think we mentioned this, but Disneyland is open till midnight tonight, so we'll be here gone midnight. Well, so. we're hoping to be here yeah. till that long. I've got a monster ready. Yeah. Ready um, and waiting, but so... that's why we want to chill out. We want to just kind of sit there, people watch, eat some food, drink some drinks, and just kind of take it all in while we're here. Yeah, I'm just trying to find a popcorn stand because I want some popcorn. Get yourself. I think it's on the other... Oh, I might, I might, I might be able to see it, actually. Get yourself some popcorn. You yeah, deserve it. Yeah, because I didn't get any in Florida did I last trip. Well, I'd, I got that one that was um, already made up. Yeah. It weren't the fresh one. Well, I have no idea what I'm getting. So, as soon as I get something... I'm gonna show you. Okay, so I know I said I was getting a snack, but I went into what is originally Casey's. It's obviously not Casey's here. I think it's called Refreshment Corner. Yeah, uh, and I went there to grab a, a coat with ice, and then I noticed that they sold mac and cheese dogs. And if you look at this mac and cheese dog, you can tell it isn't Casey's because it looks nothing alike. So I, I don't think I can grab it because, I mean, look how wide it is. It's about as wide as my hand, so I can't grab it and physically eat it as a hot dog yet. But I'm gonna rip it off a little bit and so just try it. So we a hot dog with a fork. Yeah, I don't like doing that. You're being that guy. <laughs> I'll be that guy. They also apparently sell chili cheese dogs, guys. And if you know my palaver when I went to Disneyland Paris and I ordered a chili cheese dog, do you remember? And I was so excited about it. Well, well now I can get a real one. You can. Well, that Yay. hot dog is amazing. It's is really, it? Yeah, it's, it tastes like a really, really good hot dog. Obviously, you can get crap ones. You know the ones in the tin, but it tastes like a really, really good Costco hot dog. Mm. And you're gonna love that mac and cheese, it's amazing. Ooh. I love um, the crispy bacon bits on top as well. Yeah, I noticed it had bacon on it. Yeah, it's got a lot of bacon on it, but I'm a huge fan of bacon, so. And you got a Disney Coke? Yeah, I also How noticed much? as well, um, in total it was $17. That's but amazing. I noticed as well, Dasani water is $4.75, so bring your own water. That's oh my God, ridiculous. guys, yeah. Yeah, literally, it's, that is, that's why we go and go to Walmart or Target yeah. and get bot like bottles before you know, like on landing day. Yeah, honestly. Because the bottles here are just ridiculous. I think price. that large Coke is the same price as a bottle of water. That's yeah. mental, because it's yeah. only water. Yeah, it's ridiculous that. Yeah. Oh, just go to Starbucks, get free ice water. Do that, bring those sachets in, pour it in. We did it yesterday, it's perfect. Banged in. And I finally got my popcorn, guys. It's just it, I have already started eating it, to be fair. I think it's just plain or like butter popcorn. And it's just from this stand. You can see over there, there's a castle just on Main Street and it was 5.75. Not as fresh as I wanted it to be because I feel like they'd already made it about 10 minutes ago before I ordered, but it's still really good. We've officially done with our little Main Street chill now. Uh, we had some snacks and food and drinks. We watched the parade, which was nice again. Yeah, Merlin went 
like as much of a vibe as he was the other day. Yeah, different, was different cast member. Different Merlin, but he was, was great still. Yeah, still great. It was that... nice to see it. I, lo I love the song. Uh, like, so do I. I like, <laughs> it's so good. It is great. Yeah, it's really good. Um, but just before we head out, we've just come and walked Nate, Indiana Jones, and we've just realised it's at a 25 minute wait, which... Well, we'd planned, we were walking to Pirates, because yes. we checked wait times and that was showing, was it 25, yeah, 20? Yeah, yeah. But we walked, we walked past Indiana, which is first, it was showing 25 and we thought, let's do that, because Definitely. Pirates is, usually when we've been looking, it's always been lower than Indiana, and yeah. Indiana can get up to some high it can, yeah, wait yeah, times, sure. so, and the literal the queue, we can see it, and it's, it's looking great, so yeah. we're going to get in this now. Yeah, so after we've jumped on Indiana, we're not actually going to go on Pirates, because we said we're going to get on one more ride before we head down to downtown Disney. Yeah, so, and we've chosen Indiana. Indiana while it's at 25. Yes, and we've decided to film this time because the first time we didn't, so I'm going to do my very, very best. But if any of you guys know Dinosaur or Indiana, it is crazy. So I'll do my very, very best. I don't know how it's going to turn out, but let's go and jump on Indiana Jones. I'm so excited. So ready. Glittering gold, it is yours. Indiana was so so Sick. good. It was. I think it was a little bit less than 25 minutes to be honest with you. Yeah, and plus we were just saying this. I felt like that was way better than the yes. first time we rode it. Like it felt faster. I was being like thrown around yep. more. We were sat in the middle row as well, by the way, row two, like bang in the in the middle. So I don't know because normally the back row was yeah, well, faster and stuff. But this felt just a better. Yeah. Well, right. typically the back row is the best. It's usually the one that goes the highest and you get thrown around the most. But I too felt like I was being thrown around a lot more. It could be because I worked hard and I was trying to film. But I definitely no, enjoyed I it. I wasn't filming, so... And yeah, I felt the I same suppose. as you. I definitely enjoyed it yeah. a lot more this time. Uh, it was great. But we came out and the queue shot up to over 55. In fact, for some reason, the cast members are still outside of it and they actually closed off the line. I don't know why. I know, because it's still running. The ride wasn't yeah. down, so I don't know whether it gets to a certain level wait capacity. Time or something, yeah, and they just like close it for a bit yeah. to like monitor it, which fair play. Yeah, I mean. It was showing 55, weren't it? But do you know what? I enjoyed it so much more the second time round. It was great. I did. I appreciate it a lot more than so I did right. the first time, actually. Yeah. It is a really good ride. But, and hopefully, you got some good footage. And hopefully, you could have heard us because obviously, there was announcing a parade show, I think. No. It was oh. um, the flag retreat thing that we saw the other We've day. Seen that. Yeah. yeah, yeah. So yeah, we're just gonna head to downtown Disney now. I'm yeah. very excited to see it. So am I. It's um, as well just for you guys. If you have not been, the location wise is like in between the two parks. Like it's yeah. what two minute walking distance. From I, here. It's not like Disney Springs and Walt yeah. Disney World. I love that it doesn't take an hour to get to places. It's literally yes. five minutes and you're there. And that's including all the in the hotel. same area. Yeah, I yeah. love that about yeah. this. Me too, to be fair. Yeah. So let's head on out of uh, Disneyland and let's head to downtown Disney. <laughs> So if you look here, you can see that the light is on for Walt's apartment. I love that we can actually see it as well. That's definitely one of the uh, the highlights of the trip for sure already. I love it. Okay, so for location, that's Disneyland over there. And if I pan, I'm going to have to do it slowly. If you come out of Disneyland and turn right, there's an idiot in the way here. Um, we think it's over in this direction. We, c we saw World of Disney, didn't we, somewhere? What a right there. Oh yeah, I can see it. Yeah, so it's just over here. So let's go see what shops they have and stuff. I'm excited. Me too. Got Earl of Sandwich. And then we can see World of Disney. Oh, a nice little fountain. I thought I was going to wipe that woman then. I did actually. <laughs> oh, it's blowing a bit of the uh, 
the aftermath the on this. Oh yeah, I like that. Yeah, because it is Keep it warm. Going. It oh. is, yeah. It'd be rude not to have a little walk in here as we're passing. We'll show you some bits. I've already seen, well, Steve's modelling it for me. I love this dress. Who's it got on it, Minnie? Sorry, but that's a bit of me, that, innit? I, yeah, you know what? This is a bit of you, to be honest. It's very pink, so yeah. Pink and red, love this, that. How much? Not bad, $70. I don't think that's crazy bad. Nah, that's actually not too bad. They no. also have um, a red polka dot one, but I'm more about the floral one here. I love that. I've never seen that before. Is it actually Disney's own? Uh, yes. Oh, Put it away, we don't have a kid. Um, find you some flip-flops though, mate. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this, and this is a disaster. I have no <laughs> flip-flops, so I need to oh, go buy go. some because I'm not going through all this trip without wearing flip-flops. But I'm not getting these. Apparently, there's a Javianas in here, so... Oh, I my might, God, yeah. Right. I might have to pick some we'll up We'll have to today. look in there, yeah. Look at this. $40. I am loving this range, you know. I love the colour scheme. She's seen the a pillow that she really likes. It's behind her. Well, I'm, I'm not going to get it because it would never go with our colour scheme. But look how cute it is. It's very bright. I, you rarely see mini merch that's really nice. Do you that, know what I mean? Yeah, that'll like set you back $35, that. Uh, it's quite expensive for a pillow, right? Yeah, I do like it. I feel like that's a blanket as well down there. Is it a towel? This is a quite, towel. Oh, is it a beach towel? No price on it, though. Nice. So there's actually a few things I like here. I like this. Oh, cheeky. Cheeky little find. It's a nice thing. That's $55. I really, really it's navy like that. Maybe as well. I don't know if it's showing that well on camera, but look, I was looking more at this. Oh, look at that. Look at that clock. I put it in the garage wall. Yeah, actually, I was thinking we could, it would look nice in the guest room. However, yeah, the garage oh, could work. Oh, the guest room. I feel like there's too much stuff on the wall right. in our guest room, though, isn't it? In the... Yeah, we'll make it tacky. That'll be tacky. Yeah, it'd be but too much. We're not about that. Listen, sometimes I'm cleaning can and thinking, what time is it? I could do one of them. How I... much for the clock? 30, sorry, $55. Oh, that's that's quite a lot, actually. Not, not worth that. No, because um, I bet you it's quite like, oh, you, know, you can feel it. Yeah, it's a bit oh. it's plastic. Yeah, it's not the best quality. But I do However, like these socks. Good quality socks. Yeah. Now, I can't find a price. I have been checking. I don't know how much these cost, but I, I especially like these ones. You know we love a sock, guys. I love a sock. This has to be the most random thing I've ever seen in a Disney What's store. On it? Nothing. <laughs> oh. It's just, it's just a basic no. beanie. No. It's, it's a basic beanie for $10. $10? It's like a quid at home. Go to Primark, get it for a quid. You get a Primark, you get it for 50p. Well, yeah. Guys, look. You also have my jumper. I do. Oh, they have it, yeah. They I... have it in um, the popper style as well, so they have it in this blue. I do like this colour, me. I like that colour as well, yeah. I love the style. And then obviously they have the black one, which yeah. Nat's got, that's the popper's one. That's a bit more cropped. Do you know what? Then my zip one, which is there. I wish they had something that said Disneyland on it to kind of differentiate, you know yeah, what I mean? Yeah, like they do, yeah. the tops. Just have Disneyland underneath it. You see that? Yeah, they could do, couldn't they? they could it's have the done. same range. Yeah. I'm on the lookout for a hoodie with this Mickey graphic on. I know that they do it, I just don't know if they still sell it anymore. It's $35, that. For and the, the jackets are still $70 here. Okay. That's good. And there's just a plain. Plain black Mickey there as well. And then this one as well, Luz. Oh, they do it in red as well, look. Decent pairs of socks, and in red. The maroon coloured. I like. Hmm, yeah. I do like this colour. Yeah, I like it. It's more colour. maroon, I don't know what colour it's showing on camera, but. That is nice. Guys, if there's ever more a range that is me, it's the snack range. And Disney I'm... Eats range. Sorry, yeah, the Disney Eats, I mean. Same thing. Snack rolls. But look. Right, and this is the back. That's the back of it, which we love a graphic on the back. You guys know what's on the front. The, the, obviously the D for the Disneyland. Oh my God, okay, I, lo I love it. <gasps> pretzel. And, and also, look at that down there as well, it says Disney Eats. Yeah. Uh, you got your pretzel, your donut, your uh, Rice Krispie cake, I'm assuming, and your churro. Yeah, that's nice, actually. How much is this? This is $35, so. I'm, I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get it, and I, I'm, I might wear it tomorrow, you know. Yeah, yeah, what size is that? This is large. Yeah. Yeah. But oh, amazing. How much me is this? You know when you said you wanted flip flops? Yeah. Do you oh. not want some Crocs instead to match? I'm not quite on the, uh, listen, I appreciate people <laughs> who like them, but I'm not quite there yet. 
Not for me then. They're very loud. Very loud. And I'm a loud very person. Very loud Crocs. I know, yeah. Just if anyone likes Crocs, these are $70. Oof, put them back. Guys, forget about Steve's snack tea. To be fair though, I do okay. like these. They are nice. Aren't they really nice? I think yeah. I've still got one pack left at home still so i might pick up one pack you know these are 6.99 you know where this is going don't you it's going straight, straight back. back so i've just come across the navy and it's the last one in my size so i think i'm going to pick this up as well it's the same one that viv's got and it's I large right it. uh, it's a large yeah. yeah how much again 70 dollars, i think oh no hang on let me just let me get it right 70 dollars. yeah 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 so 35 and 70. i think i'm going to pick up a gray version of this but the stand that we saw them in didn't have my size and I'm also, I really want this. Again, they don't have my size yet, but I'm going to be on the hunt. So that's the back, turn I it over. I love this, by the way. And that's the front. And, and it's stunning. a cream, not white. I don't know if it's showing white in camera. It's just a typical jumper. I don't even, it's not a spirit jersey, is it? No, I don't How think much? so. 55? 60. You know what? I, I, I love it. I you know what? Really I'd pay that, that for it. So I love how that's on the back yeah. and then on the front there's not much. They have it in red as well. Yeah, they do have a red one as well, which is nice. But the cream is much nicer, I think. The cream is much, I'd wear the cream a lot more. Yeah. But yeah, I'm going to be on the hunt for these in my size. So guys, I'm in love with everything of this home section. That is really nice, that's $35. Little Mickey with a rainbow in a black frame. Can we just show you this thing that we really, really want? But when I tell you it's heavy, I truly, truly mean it is heavy. Like, Jesus. Yeah, look how cute this is. Yeah, and when we tell you it's heavy, it's literally, I mean, it would be, our suitcase would be over the luggage allowance just That's by carrying this. Like, $50 that'll be, but it's like, it's, it's top quality. Yeah, it's literally a weight inside, yeah. but I love it. Like that, the color scheme of this entire home range, I think it's new. But by the time this vlog goes up, it might not be new. Yeah, for sure. And they've got a really nice cushion as well, which is on the oh, other side. Oh, I need to show you this cushion, yeah. I'll just grab it. Oh, can you grab it? Look and you know at what? this. It's great It's just quality. a plain cream Mickey, and the quality is sick. They also have a home one as well, which is nice. That is nice too. How much? Again, I can't see a price. So I'm not sure. I'm assuming similar, $45. And then a cute blanket. Yeah. I think that we can get this on Shop Disney in the UK, you know, this range, because I'm pretty sure I saw someone. Well, the, um, the throw set you back $70. Hmm. That's quite expensive, though. It is really expensive, this range, but I am obsessed with it. Oh, my God. Wait, I can't get it off. Look at that. That's nice, isn't it? Look at the tassels. Love that. I, I did want to get tea towel last time, but we didn't did. see any that were like... That I'll prefer, do you know, like colour scheme wise and yeah. stuff. This is twenty dollars. Oh, they have some more here. Oh, these are two. Actually, I might have to get these ones instead. Actually, look at that. Look at the pattern on that. I like it. And it's got little bobbles. And then that one. This is our colour scheme, the blue. These are. Oh, twenty-five for two. The other one's 20. I'd get the two, me. Get the two? Yeah, I'm yeah. gonna get these. Don't even have to think about it. Yes. Also seen these, Ratatouille ones. I, I like it as well. I like this one. However, I'm not a massive fan of this one. Yeah, the yellow don't go. No. Same price? Um, yeah, 25. It's not bad Can we two. mix and match? I'll take them too. Yeah. Aww. Emma will appreciate that from Disney Wives. Love she it. loves Ratatouille, doesn't she? Yeah, yeah. Oh. I love them. So we've just come to a Lion King section and look at this jumper. This range is sick. That is stunning. How that much? That will set you back $60. That is nice. Nothing on the back, obviously. Nah. Look at this blanket, though. This is what caught my eye. No, sorry. Towel. Towel, yeah. Beach towel. $30. I love this range and as well. I love that. Your lounge fly as well. Crocs to match your towel? Uh, absolutely not. Yeah, but they're the best Crocs I've seen. Yeah. No, I, I do love this range. It's oh, really. Oh, look at the ears, nice. actually. They're cute. 
How much are they going to set you back? $34.99. They're getting expensive, these ears. Yeah, they're quite padded, though, them ones. Yeah, but... And that, yeah, I, I, I'm not justifying it, but... I've never seen the strange before. No, I've never even seen anyone wear it, have you? That hoodie's my favourite. So I'm not going to pick them up just yet. I do want to go to the Haviana store, but these are a potential idol yeah, like we them. just saw them hanging here. And I love the subtlety. $35, so I like the fact that it isn't screaming Disney, but yeah. I don't know, they're from Disneyland, you know what I mean? Yeah, and they're playing black, which is a good colour. Yeah, $35, so like I said, we'll check the Havianas out itself. Yeah, we could come back for these. Or we'll come back These for are it. a potential. Yeah. So we've just come to pay at the till, and can we all just appreciate this original artwork that's actually been stained into the, uh, the desk. And the animator actually worked on 101 Dalmatians, Jungle Book, uh, Peter Pan, and over here, We've got another piece of art here where the animator also worked on Sleeping Beauty but also helped to design the ride. I love that. That's, in That's incredible. Wow. I want to take it home. So we've just paid and Lucy has now seen even more things she wants. That is stunning. They don't um, have my size again, standard, but look at the, like, the design on that. And then we saw a guy in the queue holding this t-shirt and I was like, I need that. Well, the jumper's 55 and the t-shirt will set you back 35. That's XL for an oversized look. I love that it's not white as well. It's like an off pink. Is it? Yeah, like, or like a lilac is what I'm, get, yeah. I'm getting from it. I love that. Well, think about it before we go, because actually we don't have many days left here now, but that's why we're buying things now. Uh, because if we don't have our sizes, we don't have much time left to search. So think about it, you might want it. No, I do want it. All right, just thought about it. <laughs> don't need to think about it. <laughs> Straight in your basket. So, World of Disney was a huge success. I think I spent about 113, and Lucy spent about 80 or something. I don't know what my total is, actually. But she got um, the t-shirt anyway. I also, I got her my mouth on set. Ooh, you grab. Love that. Um, this world of Disney is massive. It is. But it's still going. Look, it's going on and on and on. So I actually don't know what else is in downtown Disney yet. I can see a Starbucks though. Yeah, so I definitely want another caramel ribbon crunch because, well, I can't get them in the UK. So every time I see a Starbucks, I'm like, <laughs> give me Do you want to get one now while we're passing Starbucks? Um, no, I'll tell you what, I'll get one on the way back when we drop these off. Okay, yeah. Okay. So we can get it once we leave in downtown Disney, yes. yeah? Right, okay. I can see a Pandora. I see sunglass hot. And I can see a Sephora for all you makeup loving girlies out there. Um, I'll tell you what, let's just do a tour of downtown Disney. So here's the Starbucks, which actually looks really dead considering, because in Florida they're always busy. Yeah. I've also seen as well, they do a really, really nice pair of sunglasses, uh, Disney ones, and they just brought out a new range, but Lucy said they look silly on my head. So, unfortunately I won't Excuse be getting me, them. they did though, didn't they? Yeah, yeah. You no, did no, agree. But there is a new pair that I do like, and um, I would like them about $230 though, which is a shame, because I'd rather spend it on some outs that I, I yeah. do actually need. So to our right, as we're walking past, is that's an, that's an Italian. Oh, salt and straw. So salt and straw, guys, if you don't know, do really weird flavors. Yes, so if you look here, right, so it has strawberry honey balsamic with black pepper, pear and blue cheese flavor. Honey lavender. Uh, peanut butter, brittle caramel fudge, that'd be nice. They also do olive oil flavor, for you what? guys who love a bit of olive oil. Um, they also do some that sound really nice, to be fair, like salted, malted, chocolate chip, cookie dough, but cinnamon also, Snickers. Now, if you're thinking oh, they're not going to be busy, right, they are really busy. I mean, queues coming out the door busy. So, it's got to be good. I know it sounds horrible, but it's got to be good. And we always say smell vision guys. If you could smell oh. this right now, what, so in I need the a air, candle that smells of like that. In the air, it smells it's like, like caramel. Chocolate caramel and barbecue is the scent as you walk through barbecue, downtown. Barbecue, I'm not getting that. No, not, not just, stood right here. Oh, right, right. <laughs> I was going to say, I can't smell that here. This smells incredible, though. Yeah. And the queue's out the door, so it must be good. It means we've got to try it before we go. Black tap, this is meant to be good. I've heard good things. Never been there. No, but good burgers. it does say crazy shakes, so I'm assuming they do really good milkshakes as well. Yeah, fries and rings, which will obviously be onion rings. Hmm. <gasps> There's a Disney home. Is that a home? <gasps> Disney home shop on its own. Right, let's go in. Not that we've not just spent loads anyway. To be fair, it's probably got a lot of the same stuff, but they might have a little bit more. I feel like they have artwork as well. Oh, really? Wow. Well, there's, there's an artwork in the, the window there. 
So we have just seen all of this stuff as well. They've got the clock down here. Oh my God, Luce, look. I know, I feel like we need that. How much is that, 150? Yeah, $150. Oh my God, and that D on the wall as well, is that for sale? Look at that D. Oh. Is that for sale? That's what They'll I just take said. It. Yeah, she's right, they do have some artwork. I do absolutely love this, it's from Red. I do like that, and obviously, Encanto. That would look really nice in our house because of the colours, because it's so, so bright. And Shang-Chi as well, wow. I've never seen this before, but I do really like it. What have we got around here? Oh, Nana! You know what, right, I'm not a huge fan of, it's a small word, but I do really, really like this piece. This is $200. So we've just come to the end of the Disney Home Store and there is loads of artwork and Lucy's found a really cool Guardians one. I want it, but I want not this one because this is $249. So you want the fake I want coffee. the fake one, yeah, but I can't see it anywhere. Also, an amazing haunted mansion with a mm. Madame Leota. This is a really popular one, the, uh, the cast member said. And of course, they've got it in a cheaper version for us normal folk. <laughs> Wow, Encanto as well. These are stunning. So we didn't see these in the other store, did we? No, because we have actually looked in DCA, didn't we, at an art, art um, shop. Yeah. We didn't see these ones. Tarzan? I've never seen a piece of art from a Tarzan before. Oh my, oh. Look, that's a square as well, so it's a different shape to the normal ones. I want to see if we can get some more detail. That is stunning. $400, that'll set you back. And this little uh, petite print will set you back $35. Oh, look at this. this oh, is the potential. villains. I think this is potential loose. I like it. Oh, is it? it? Okay. Look at this one with all the villains. Love the colours. Just sat on the chairs. I love like the cartoon versions. And the colours. This is $5,000. Wow. And also look at the cinders as well, Luce. Wow. Oh, she's so pretty. That'll set you back $400, is that it? That's cheap. Oh, for that, yeah. That's cheap. They also do, guys, postcard sizes as well. Oh, they do, don't but they? But they, I just feel like for our wall that we're doing in the dining room, they're just gonna look a bit lost because we've yeah. got like, kind of like that size, haven't we? So yeah. like, I mean, you could get a few, but. It'd look a bit silly. Yeah, but I think it would. And last but not least, Luce, look at Rapunzel. Now, it ain't coming up on the camera, but that is super, super shiny. So shiny. Yeah. That'll set you back $2,000. Oh. Wow. Oh. oh, they've got a thingy one. <gasps> oh, you know what? Oh no, is it another potential? Yeah, I think so. For $35 or $45, it's, I think it's really, really cheap. So I think it's definitely a potential. That is a potential, but I do feel like I would prefer the Avengers. I know Rapunzel's my girl, but, but I think if I was to pick, like to buy one right now, and that was an offer, I'd think I'd buy the Avengers one. Yeah. Well, we'll see what happens anyway. Yeah, I can't see the, the cheap version of the Avengers though. So we've just come next door to the Disney dress shop. Look at it. How much is it, Luz? Uh, I literally just looked and I can't remember now. 60. That's not bad, I like it. Just playing on the back. So, do you know what I mean? Well, it's like the ones you got in Animal Kingdom. Yeah, I Animal bought the them from the uh, Everest ride. Do you want to buy it. this one as well? Yeah, for me. No, and then I can maybe wear it as well. Thief! And it wouldn't be a downtown Disney without a massive Lego store with a dragon on the roof. <laughs> Look at Buzz and Woody here as well. Oh, yeah, and there's um, Beauty and the Beast as well over to the right. It's like a new, the, um, the new Pixar show when Buzz flies around the castle. Oh yeah, that was sick. So as we're just walking around downtown Disney, we've just seen the Disneyland Hotel. So we're gonna go and see if we're gonna head in and check out the gift shop because I'd love to buy something from there. Yeah, I think we can. It's literally right at the end of downtown Disney. We've come right to the end now. <gasps> Luce, what if they have... Oh, sorry, I thought you saw something. <laughs> one of them robes. Oh God, yeah. Oh, I've been talking about these robes for so many vlog series. I still haven't got one, so... <laughs> oh yeah. What you better time even... to get it than get? Weren't you going to get the Pixar one though? Well, I haven't seen the Disneyland one, like, even if they have one. Who knows? Yeah, it looks like we can, but it looks like if you can see to our left here, which I don't know if we really should be filming, then is security again. Oh yeah, so keep it this um, way. So I think once we've exited now, yeah, to well, go back in, we're going to have to come back around. go back through security, yeah. yeah. But I'm happy with that. I'm okay, as long as we can go and see the uh, the hotel, I'll be happy. Yeah. yeah, I think we can. <gasps> Here it is. Oh, I love this. So I hope we can get in, loose. It looks like we can. Let's go and see the uh, gift shop. So we've come to the Disneyland Hotel and oh 
My word. What? You can have it um, personalised. Oh. oh, my word. This feels amazing. It does feel amazing. Price is 100. $100. You know what? I'm going to try some on. And I, I think I may purchase this one because I feel like the Disneyland Hotel is, is more special than the Pixar one. Than the Pixar one, yeah, I agree. I'm going to try it on because I've been wanting one of these for so, so long. Well, we're rolling. Other bits of Disneyland Hotel yeah, merch. Some incredible. It's even got Look at the mug, yeah. That's sick. And a bottle, which is very similar to a corksicle. In yeah. fact, it might even be corksicle. It is corksicle. <gasps> it is corksicle. Oh, I love a corksicle cup. Um, this mug is $15. I like it. Look at the bag as well, Luce. Yeah, so that's quite cool, actually. This is not lounge fly, but it's very similar. Lug. It's lug. Oh, my word. Anyway. Let me try on a robe because I may have to pick this up right now. Yeah, love that. So I've decided to go for an extra large and I'm going to personalise it and put my name on it as well. Let's do a little zoom in of the log on So there. I think in total this will be about $115 because the lady did mention it's about $7 for personalisation and it takes roughly about an hour. I think that's so worth it. If any of you have ever felt these, they feel ridiculously good yeah like look at the inside if i just go here like it's it's like fluffy. it's not fluffy but it is like i feel uh, amazing she's gonna get me a brand new one yeah so she said you can have different colors as well so you can have gold red and like um this navy blue as well i think well, for I the think, colors um, i like the gold color so it looks I. very like vip so do i do you know what so, i mean like it's very like you know king oh, of the castle vibes king of the castle <laughs> never gonna get this and then one day he bought this. I get this. So I finally bought a robe. Oh no, it's not in there. I was gonna be like, purchase. Oh, it's no, getting it's embroidered. In. Right, yeah. okay, so, yeah. So what I wanted was the D. Whoa, hang on. Start that again, because that's sounding weird then. Um, <laughs> <laughs> so I wanted to put the letter D. No. No, your name begins with an S. Right. Hang on, I forgot how to spell my name. I'm just super excited, right? So I Basically, wanted... that sign behind him there. Yeah. He wanted the S in a different colour. And then the Teven in a different colour. The Teven in, in a gold colour with the S in the navy. The navy to match. However, yeah. she only had dark blue and it wasn't the same no. blue. So it would have been a bit off and it looks a bit yeah. off. So we've just gone for... Straight gold. Straight gold. And in total, it came to $116.35, which for yeah. a personalised original Disneyland robe. That is sick. I'm so glad I, I waited it off. But so Me too. What I'm going to do now is I could like buy different ones now. Oh you know, God, he started time, a collection, on it. And just like think, oh, today I fancy Grand Floridian, you know, or today I fancy like Pixar Hotel, you know. Yeah, 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 yeah. I but know what you mean. I've finally done it. I finally bought one. And apparently it takes about an hour. So we're going to come back in about an hour and, and pick it yeah, back up. Yeah, we may as well get it today, aren't we? Yeah. Rather than, because we're just going to, we're going to still have a little look around downtown Disney still. I'm so excited. Because we've still not seen that Javiana's shop. No, I don't, I don't know not, if. We got told there was one, but I didn't see one when I was walking yeah. then, unless it were hidden anywhere. Unless we missed it. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, we'll keep looking, but if not, I think I'll pick up those Disneyland yeah, ones. Yeah, they were nice. Yeah. And can I just show you, this in the background is the water slide. I'm not going to zoom in, but you can, the little monorails are like the slides. How sick is that? I can't believe we're actually here. I, I can't believe we're actually here. Yeah, because I know we definitely wanted to see the Pixar Hotel. Yeah. And I didn't think about coming and seeing the Disneyland no, one, really. I didn't. And then we were literally just walking towards it, and I was like, go on then. And I'm so glad we did. And it was as soon as Lucy said, like, that's the Disneyland Hotel, I just thought, oh my God, what if they sell a robe? I mean, I get a robe, yeah. me on my balcony every morning with a cup of tea, like, oh. Well, um, I hope you take it off before you have the tea because. I you don't it. want to spill on it, and you will, because you know what Steve's like wearing white, guys. I'm going to be on the king of the castle, like, mm, don't do this, don't do that. Mm, that's and I'll lock deal. you out. And then she'll lock me out. <laughs> so she'll you can't get me back off. in. See ya. See you in a bit. See you in a bit, mate. Bye. So we've just come to the concierge section of the hotel, and this is the Autopia cars through the decades. All powered by Honda, so obviously 1955, the original ones. This is where people jumped over the fences and were actually chucking people out, which is absolutely insane to think that even ever happened. And then obviously progressively through the years to what they are now. And I think I've just heard they're going electric, which is kind of a shame because that gas smell and that noise that you hear around the park is, well, it's, it's the classic, isn't it? And if you just back up a little bit here, you'll be able to see one of the uh, Autopia cars. Now, I'm not sure what area this is from, but it definitely looks old. So let's have a look on here. It could be from 1967 to 
99 it could be but don't quote me it looks like it is amazing i'd have loved loved to have seen that back in its heyday and they've also got a wall that is filled with old school memorabilia like all the way from 1950s and if you look i've just seen this as well this is what i need now they've literally got so much stuff of wall look, even like there's like um, a coin like we've got there it's it's similar oh yeah this is what ben, so ben and nat actually bought me this from uh, the antiques mall yeah it's very similar isn't it yeah, it obviously. doesn't look the exact same you've got the castle you've obviously got there's Walt actually so much and roy down here there is so so much and we keep looking at it thinking i just want everything like you could literally stand here for like a I good was. 30 minutes and having a look look at that name tag wall wow what if that's an original could be because he didn't have like cast member or anything no. written on his did he? he actually just had his name yeah they've got roy oh yeah well. this got to be the they've original be, one right they? what do i have to do to own something like that aside from be a family member yeah wow this hotel is is definitely a it's a dream hotel to stay in isn't it yeah i'd love to i mean this is a convention center so i'm wow. not too sure we're not like in like the main bits where the hotel rooms are but this is sick so this is actually one of the first mock-ups made by wed themselves but look i've got a wed tattoo as well now i do need to touch it up a bit because the colors fade a little bit now this is obviously what they wanted it to look like so you've obviously got like world of tomorrow which obviously is Tomorrowland. Where Enterprises? Uh, Mickey Mouse Club, uh, Holidayland, The Hub. Look at the castle, look how they thought the castle would have looked. When well, you go through the castle and everything's inside it. Wow. Oh, wow, look at it, it's insane. Can, I love this. I'd like this and obviously like a copy print and, and have that somewhere in our house. Wouldn't that be nice, that? So if any of you remember, um, I actually bought a picture of Walt on, on the right tracks and it actually came in this exact frame. So I'm assuming that's where it came from. I got it from the Lakeland Ant Antiques Mall. Yeah, I wonder if like it was ones here. Yeah, like it's got to have been because it looks identical. Yeah, it's exactly the same, isn't, isn't it? Isn't it? If it did come from here, that would make me feel even better about it. Like, it's an amazing print. This is, I want, I want something like this. I like that waltz on his, um, on his train as well. And I also like it is actually on Main Street. I'm assuming that was through the process of opening day. So... Yeah. I think it was actually. But I genuinely think it came from here. Yeah. Which is pretty cool, right? And that's why so you buy cool. things like that. Yeah. Love all these. And then hey. these are all like people who have been to Disney, like famous people. Macaulay Culkin. Look. Look at him. Wow. What a place, what a place. Such a good hotel, isn't it? Yeah, one day, Luce. One day. Look, I want this in our back garden, please, Stephen. Oh yeah, I'll get me specialist gardening one? gear out. I'm at the front lawn. I can barely cut the grass with a fly more. You want to see me? <laughs> Will you give it your best shot, do you know what I mean? Hey, it's the trying that counts. It's the trying that counts. But yeah, look how sick this is. I love how everywhere you turn, there's always something. Yeah. This is beautiful. So, plan now. I think we're going to leave the Disneyland Hotel. Yeah. Go back to our hotel to drop said bags off. Oh, by the way, I just want to point out, I did pick up those Javianas. We didn't find oh, the shop, yeah. but they sold them in the Disneyland Hotel. So I just thought, you know what? Grab them. We are coming back, obviously, to get the robe. But for now, we're yeah. just leaving. And I'm leaving with these uh, flip-flops. Yeah, you did get the black ones, didn't you? Yeah. So, how much were they? $37 after tax. Not bad, actually. You can never have too many flip-flops. No, so we've got our maps up, because obviously I was just said to you, I was like, I wonder if our hotel, like, we could go a different way. And it's saying how long? 20 minutes. 20 minutes from here. So we're just following it. I don't know if this is even the right way. Well, so or... the, the, the reason why we're doing this is because, obviously, to get back into downtown Disney, you have to go back through security, and the queue is huge. So we thought, why yes, don't we just... Yes, well, it was huge when we walked past, wasn't it? Yeah. So obviously it makes sense to just leave the actual hotel exit, then go back to the hotel and then make our way back through the park like we typically would where there isn't any queues. Yeah, well that's what we're thinking anyway. So we'll yeah. see how we get out. I feel like it could, this could be it because there's an exit here. Listen, Siri never lies. No, that's true. So we are just, oh look, there's a Pixar Place Hotel. Oh yeah. Hey. 
Yay! Oh, we'll have to visit that another day, I think. I think so, yeah. So we're not doing loads of hotels in one vlog and be boring you guys. Oh, I'm not um, <laughs> picking up a second robe for the for the, for the same so same day. It probably is, let's be honest. Um, well, you are probably going to get another one, right? I love them. Well, maybe not. Um, so yeah, we're going to do that and then we need some food, don't we? So I don't know what we're going to do for tea. Well, we have seen that there's a cheesecake factory near the hotel, so Ooh. I could eat a cheesecake factory. I could eat a cheesecake factory because you need to be quite hungry to be there. 100%. And I am quite hungry. I'm quite hungry too. Because I've only had that popcorn for like lunch. And what time is it now? Is it the time half six? It is half past six dead on. So that's the plan. We're going to drop this off and yeah. just probably get a cheeky cheesecake factory and then head back into Central. downtown Disney, grab my robe and then go back into Dis uh, the Disneyland park. So we're doing, are we not doing any DCA today? I don't know. Something Do you reckon? Or Because nah. we want to see the Disneyland fireworks. Then Don't know, then. tonight. Yeah, we'll see what time because it might be too late. Either way, we're in here till midnight, so. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. Right. Well, let's go back to the hotel. I might change, put a jumper on, yeah. put leggings because it's getting quite cold. Yeah, it's cooling down now. So. Yeah. So let's we'll go there. Head back to the hotel, and we'll probably catch up with you when we're eating food. Probably sure. cheesecake factory. Hopefully, there's no long queues. No, sorry. <laughs> Yeah, I love that. Yeah? Great yeah, size as well, isn't it? And yeah, he has got a big gulp because we literally just stopped at a 7-Eleven on the way back to the hotel. Oh, but he's just here. We've just literally just left the hotel and Cheesecake Factory. Well, it said 300 yards, didn't it? Yeah. Here it is. It looks like it's quite busy, but we'll see if we've got a table for two. See what wait time they give us. So they've said it's a 30-minute wait, which we don't mind waiting for. They've just given me this, uh, this pager and then as soon as it goes off, we'll get our table. Guys. This is what you come to use Cake Factory for. The menu is obviously massive. Oh, it's like a Bible. It's, it's crazy, We're crazy. We're not obviously big. going to show you the menu because you'll have to just Google it if you want to see it because it's literally, like you said, a Bible. Yeah. But this warm bread. Oh. And the butter together. It's a dream, in it? Oh. Are you going to have some of this or is it just me? This needs to be a bit melted a bit more. <laughs> However, oh. yeah, I don't really fancy any to be honest with you. Uh, How can you turn down? No, no, this brown one because I've got a big meal coming and I don't want to stodge up on bread. Is it yeah. good then? Yeah, yeah, I'm glad you're enjoying it. What's better? Obviously, I know the answer. What's better, the two thumbs emporium bread? or the Cheesecake Factory bread. The two someone. Are you had to think about that then for a second? I'm shocked. Well, they're very similar. If this had chocolate inside yeah. it, it tastes the exact same. Yeah, two some. Yeah, but so this is still gone. What have you ordered? The factory nachos. And it comes with loads of stuff like guacamole, sour cream and stuff. I've said no, no to all that. I don't want any of that. I just literally want the tortilla chips. Chicken, I've added chicken, which is an extra cost. Salsa and cheese. I'm dead easy to please, you know. So we'll see if they get it right because, like I said the other day, I got that burrito, I asked for no bacon, and it came with bacon. And they always seem to get it wrong, don't they? Well, and when I've, I asked for stuff to like be taken off and stuff, so we'll I, see. I've ordered a chicken parm, but in a pizza style. So I have had it before. Um, I actually didn't order it the first time, they gave it me by mistake, but I, I really enjoyed it and mm. I've really wanted it since, so we'll see how it is when it turns up. Yeah, strawberry lemonade, the best. Mm -hmm. 10 out of 10, though. Okay, so I've gone for the chicken parmo pizza style, which looks incredible. Got the bit of the uh, Romana pasta on top of it as well. 
Something about the lighting in here, guys, as well. Like, as you, if you guys know a cheesecake factory, it's dead dark in it, and it, yeah. it just looks, makes everything look red, even though in real life it's not. And if you're tired, it sends you to sleep. Yeah, I'm blooming knackered now, sat in here. Yes. I don't know what about it is, but I just absolutely love it. That chicken is really, really nice. It's super thin as well, so it isn't actually that filling. And I think in total it's about 1,960 calories, which ain't oh, too bad. Oh, at the calories, yeah, yeah, yeah. So basically, it's what that whole thing is just chicken, isn't it? Just chicken, the whole thing is chicken. And then you've got like spaghetti, is it, on top? Yeah, like Romana pasta on it, and oh, yeah, a, obviously a sauce. Um, like a tomato and basil sauce yeah. and it's it's so simple but I absolutely love it go on get it in there so Lucy's a bit confused she's not sure if it is actually chicken but I've tasted it it is chicken it looks like a chicken paste you would think like it would be actual chicken pieces on it right no she's saying this is because it's got sweet corn in it which is weird we've never seen chicken added on top with sweet corn in it and they give the salsa on the side, not on the... Which she did ask me if I wanted, I said, you choose, because I'll, I'll happily have it on the nachos or not. Try it, see what you think. It's really nice, I've tried it, and I, you know what I'm like. What do you think? It's nice, isn't it? Whatever it is, it's nice. <laughs> <laughs> Whether it's chicken or not. It also looks like you ain't going to finish it. also looks like I'm probably going to have about three and be full, but... I like. <laughs> okay, so I went for a brand new one. I've never had this before. It's the Ghirardelli Very Cherry. So I thought, do you know what? Let's just go for one that I've never tried before and see how we get it. It's Ghirardelli, so it's got to be good, right? Yeah. It tastes like um, a very thick chocolate ganache with Cherry Batewell in it. Now, I actually don't like cherry, the f you know, the actual cherry itself, but I do like the flavour. Mmm. It's very, very cold. And that chocolate base is incredible. I don't know why I've never got this before. It's really, really nice. And it smells incredible. Mmm. I'm going to enjoy this. 20 minutes later. So as you can tell now guys, we are back in the park, but I just brought you here to the uh, fire department just so you can see what Walt's light looks like. Come here, I just appreciate how incredible that is. Oh, could you imagine just like wandering around and he's just in the window waving at you? Could you, what a time, eh? I'm so glad that they managed to um, uh, bring down the scrim and we got to see it. Cause I'd have been just gutted if we never got to see it while we are here. I mean, I suppose we'd come back, but I'm glad they brought it down, definitely. Hi, Walt. Hello. We just uh, boarded this, what's it called? Astro Orbiters, um, to see the fireworks. Fireworks have just ended, so here we go. Wow. Woohoo! Are you okay? It's beautiful. Is that how it's fireworks? Oh, yeah. Typical. Nice man. So we've decided to leave my robe until tomorrow because obviously it closes at 10 o'clock. We don't want to be yeah. rushing around like crazy people. Yeah, I just had a look on the um, Disneyland app and I zoomed into the hotel and put like shops as a filter and it said 10, it's short. Yeah. So we'd be cutting it fine and I'm not rushing all the way and then we'd get oh, there and no. it's short, do you know what I mean? And like I said to Lucy, they'll keep hold of it anyway, they're not going to bin it anyway. Right. So you keep hold of it for a, you know, a couple of days. But we decided now to try and jump on for the first time um, Hyperspace Mountain because we've not done it yet. And no. we really want to know. Last time I checked, it was posted at a 25 minute wait. So we'll I think see how. It still says the same on the outside. Yeah, there's so a lot of people running in though. There's a lot of people going in from the fireworks have literally ascended. Yeah. But it's still saying 25. So fingers crossed. I love this queue. This space mountain. How close you get the first? Isn't that insane? So after 40 minutes of waiting in the queue for Space Mountain, we've decided to bail. 
Um, we got in there, it was 25 minutes, and then I think after the fireworks had finished, everybody were lightning lane went to Space Mountain, mm -hmm. Hyper Space Mountain, so they just weren't letting the regular queue in. So, like I said, after 40 minutes, we thought, you know what, that's Sonic, there's a lot of rides that are walk ons. Yeah. So, we now are at Autopia, which is a five minute way, so we haven't done it in the night yet, so it's going to be sick. Oh, yeah. So, we've decided Lucy is driving this time. I don't think I've ever been in the car with you while you were driving, have you? I can't remember. I can't remember. No, I have remember. And the car was broke and it kept going to the side. Oh. It weren't my driving, it was actually broke. Oh, yeah. So. Yeah, that was the only time, but that was a long time ago. Um, was that in Paris or Florida? I don't yeah, know. I think that was Paris. So she's doing it again. Homemade Schumacher. 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 Here we go, with a top speed of six and a half mile an hour on a one kilometre track, Lucy Schumacher. There she is, <laughs> she ladies is. and gentlemen. <laughs> I'm doing well better than that car in front, look at them. It's all over bloody place. You're doing really well. Wait till we start turning first. Oh God. Can you see my concentration face? <laughs> yeah. Oh. Tight squeezing air with Steve's bag. And my ass. <laughs> my leg hurts already. Do you want me to do it on for the you? Pedal. Are no. You, are you sure? They don't call me Schumacher for nothing. <laughs> they don't. <laughs> oh, yeah, they do. You catching him up? Yeah, I am. You're loose. You did really well. Look at the registration plate on the back of this one. Walt Disney the World 071, the power of dreams. Oh, I wonder what airs is. Oh, do you think they're all like that? I don't know, but that looks like a DeLorean over there. It does. I'll check when we get out. I love that all the plates on the back of the cars have their own like, little hidden Disney thing on them. Like, obviously, we saw one then as we got off. It said DCA 001, so it's pretty cool how they're all different. And I'm assuming the ones that say like Seth 34 could be cast members or yeah you know, one like, was i saw one that said kelly on it yeah so so cast members are famous imagineers and you know people have had massive influence within the, the disney company so yeah. that's pretty cool um but we are off now and we've Guys. just seen hey look what she's got so story behind these from goofy movie so the last two trips in florida i've wanted these but i've always forgot about them or couldn't see them then we were just in World of Disney earlier, and there were loads. So I picked up four. Yeah. And I'm just gonna have one now because I keep thinking about it, but we kept going to rides and I was like, I can't, but I think we're gonna go to Thunder Mountain now. Yes. So I'm gonna eat it on the walk. Yeah, because we've just checked at Pirates Sour Lime, five. by the way, it is. Sour Lime Taffy, basically. Yeah, so Pirates is five, and uh, Big Thunder is five, so we're gonna jump uh, over there and jump on those rides. Look at the colour of that. Is it as good as it used to be? Oh, yeah, we had it. Oh, I thought you knew what they were. No. Oh. Oh, yeah. Is it decent? Is it like a refresher? Yeah. Is it? Yeah, so it's just a simple candy, but this is a bit of either. Except a refresher is 10 pence, and those are just over $3. Two summit, one out of it. $2.99 before tax. Oh, wow. Where's the nest?
Yeah, Big Thunder was virtually a walk-on, which is insane to think yeah. that Space Mountain is around about 65, but everything else is a walk-on. Is Space Mountain some sort of really amazing ride that we don't know of? I don't think like, so. <laughs> I feel like it's just the same as the Florida one, but yeah. you sit in a pair, not on your own. Yeah, I don't know. I don't like, know. Like I said, we will Excuse do it. if I'm wrong, but... We, we will do it. We'll get it done really early at some point. Obviously, one of our last days in, yeah. in the Disney park. Um, but while we have this last final hour before, obviously, midnight, because we are until midnight, um, we're going to try and jump on as many as we possibly can now. We've just seen that Pirates is also a five minute wait. So again, virtually a walk, so we're going to head straight over to there and uh, get Pirates out of the way tonight. Yay, I'm excited. I love this Pirates ride. It's sick. Work it. That's it, girl. That's it. Show them who you are. A whore. <laughs> Look at your face. You're an idiot. And just like that, guys, that is the end of another amazing day here in the Magic Kingdom. Our longest day yet. Our longest day yet. Because it's literally midnight as we speak. Yep. We've just announced that the park's closed. Yeah, and we have been here since park opening. So, like you said, like Lou said, it, it has been Ugh. a long, long day. But we've done so, so much. I've bought some merch. I've got oh, my yeah, new. Yeah, we spent some money. Yeah, I spent some money. I've got a new jacket. Just want to put it while we're ending this. The, the vehicles are still moving, the Disney, Disneyland transport vehicles go all day and all the way through the, through the night. It's midnight now and this bus is absolutely rammed. Like you don't get that in Florida, do you? <laughs> look at them. I know, look at everyone. I'm kind of jealous. I don't think, oh, they're all singing oh, happy uh, birthday. Yeah. Um, I was going to say, I'm really jealous, I don't think I can walk down Main Street so I need one of these vehicles, <laughs> my feet are killing. Yeah, her feet are killing. We're just having a little sit down, it's because we've not, I've not sat down all day. <laughs> no, we, we've literally because been Because when non -stop. you had that hot dog, don't yeah. know what it had on it, I've got mac and cheese, yeah. and I had popcorn. Obviously, if anyone knows Steve, he wanted to sit in the sun and I got too hot, so I had to just stand up in the shade. So I have not actually sat down much. But no, we've, That's why I bought. Like I said, we've done so much. I finally bought that robe, which again, I need to pick it up. So I'll show you that, guys, oh, yeah. next week. Um, I got this new jacket, a new t shirt. Lucy bought some things. It's been. We spent some cash today, spent guys. Some bloody money. So, since we last spoke, what did we last film? Uh, we went on to Thunder Pirates, Man. I think. Pirates. Pirates. I did say we were going out, it was a walk on. Um, yes, yeah, so we did Pirates and it was a walk on. We literally yeah. walked all the way up and then the doors opened and we got on. It was yeah. like so smooth on it. And yeah. then we thought, you know what, we'll try Indiana Jones again. And that too was also a walk on. It said 20 minutes, but it wasn't. Yeah. Like the queue, if you know, is long. <laughs> and there's a Disney duck as well, look. He's just chilling, eating all the leftover yeah. food. Everyone's left on the floor. Um, but yeah, Indiana Jones was another walk on, and we could have literally just about probably got back in yeah, the queue and gone on it again, couldn't we? But, but if anybody knows the in we'll Indiana Jones say. queue, it yeah. goes on for miles. So yeah, <sighs> to save Lucy's feet, we thought, you know what, let's just head back to Main Street and just sit in front of um, Sleeping Beauty's castle because yeah. it is beautiful. Oh, we love it. It's just a vibe, innit? Yeah, the music, everything. Yeah, and I'm happy to sit down for a bit. Like, I'm tired, but I'm not, like, flagging too much where I could... Yeah. I mean, I probably could fall asleep right now. Oh, you would, yeah. I'd probably be carrying home. <laughs> the bags are heavy enough. Can we hire, um, hire a push chair or something? I'll just push get one of those uh, vehicle transports and drive <laughs> you back. <laughs> yeah. Excuse can, me. Can you just, like, do a bit further, yeah. please, mate? Do you know who I am? <laughs> Subscribe. <laughs> Yeah, so that is the end anyway. of another day here. So we are, of course, going to end this vlog here because we're not going to get up to any much uh, much more. We're going to head back to the hotel and go to bed. So Ooh, yeah, my bed, the bed's calling my name. Yeah, after we've chilled out here a little bit longer though. Yeah, we can just sit here for a bit. I'm yeah. going to rest my feet for like another 10 minutes, let's say. <laughs> yeah. Then so, we'll do the walk. With that being said, guys, thank you guys so much for watching. Please thank you so much. do like and subscribe. And leave a comment. If you have enjoyed this video, mm -hmm. have a wonderful evening. And we will see you next time. Bye. Bye. Are we oh, up? we going up? Yeah. We got it. Guys, we got it.
What is it, 10 past midnight now or something? We're still jumping on the transportation. Rest them feet of yours. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Whee! Oh, there's Walter Mickey. Perfect ending loose. Bye bye. Bye bye. 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 Bye bye, bye, -bye. bye, -bye now. 1 a.m. these transportation vehicles run till. The shops close at 1 a.m. but the rides shut at 12. How insane is that? I wish Magic Kingdom did this as well. Hey, he's got a bucket hoodie on. Oh, look at that. My man. We are now making our final approach. Please stay seated for ring the bus to a fully complete stop and I have turned off the engine and lowered the rope for you to exit the vehicle. Thank you for visiting the Disneyland Resort. Have yourself a wonderful and safe journey home, wherever that may be. Good night, Walt. Good night. Love you. Get out!